Thank you, thank you. Welcome aboard the Vermilion family. <laughs> Day three, we just finished breakfast at Cabanas. You guys can see what we had. Now we're headed to O'Gill's for some Disney Cruise Line trivia, which we're probably not gonna do very good at, but we're gonna try for it anyway. It's 18 or older only. The area on the Disney Magic, Dream, and Fantasy is named after a character from The Incredibles. <laughs> which refreshment area on the Disney Magic? Dream and Fantasy is named after a character from The Incredibles. <laughs> is home port to the Disney Magic during select European cruises. Which English port is home port to the Disney Magic during select European cruises? Adventures in that book on the Magic from Manchester. Manchester. A cool area on the fantasy of dream. Satellite Falls. Yep. You got two correct. Number six during the Alaska season, which port is the home port of the Disney Wonder? Vancouver. Vancouver. Seven, Mariah Carey is the godmother of the Disney fantasy, but who hosted the christening ceremony in 2012? Julie Andrews. I would have loved that. It was Neil Patrick Harris. Oh, no. He's everywhere. Oops. Number eight. What is the name of the lounge dedicated to family game shows and events across the fleet of the DCL ships? The lounge. The lounge, yep. And number nine. O'Gill's Pub can be found on which two Disney Cruise Line ships? Fantasy and Magic. Disney Fantasy and Disney Magic. Yes, you got it. Number 10, what is the name given to the large screen above the stage on the open deck? Funnel Vision. Funnel Vision. 11, which English port is home to the port, is home to, <laughs> is home port to the Disney Magic during select European cruises? Dover. Dover. Oh. Dover. I had no idea. Number 12, the main no pool on the Disney Fantasy is named after which character? Don't do the duck. Number 13, name the two water slides on the Disney Magic. <coughs> Aqua Dunk and the Mickey Slide. Aqua Dunk and Twist and Spell. I get that one right. <coughs> Number 14, what is the Broadway style spectacular new to the Disney Dream since 2017? Frozen. No. Beauty Frozen. and the Beast. Oh. No idea. Number 15, which two Disney Cruise Line ships sail out of Port Canaveral all year round? Fantasy and the Wish. Fantasy and the Dream. Probably the Wish as well. For now. That, yeah, it's Fantasy and Wish. That. 16. Dream. The Dream is in Europe. It's headed to Europe. Dream's headed to Europe right now. <laughs> we got that one right. It's the Fantasy and the Wish. We got that one right. Fantasy and the Wish. <laughs> they need to update their questions. <laughs> their answers are wrong. <laughs> 16, what is the name of the other exclusive piano bar on the Disney Magic? Keys. 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 Yeah, makes sense. Number 17, what is the port of registry for DCL fleet? Bahamas. Nassau. Nassau, Bahamas. 18, which Spanish city plays host to Disney ships during dry dock? No idea. No. Cadiz? Cadiz. I didn't know that at all. Uh, number 19, what is the name of the first water coaster at sea? Aqueduct. 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 Yeah. 20, what style is the Disney Wonder decorated in? Art Deco. 
Art Nouveau. Nouveau. Oh. Art Nouveau. Number 21 in 2018 on the Disney Magic, Pete's Boiler Vibes was replaced by what? Duck in Diver. Diner. Diver. I'm just like some nice little water. Duck in Diner. <laughs> I didn't know that. Pete's Boiler Vibes must have been out. Uh, number 22, too. adult exclusive restaurant parlor serves cuisine from which country? Italy. Italy. Twenty-three. The dream was christened by Jennifer Hudson on what date? Monday. It was 2011. It was January 19th, 2011. I thought it was 2012. <laughs> uh, sorry. <laughs> How many people put 2011? I'll give you it. So, we didn't do very good at trivia, did we? No. We got 12 out of 25 right, but we got little winner medallions because some old couple, they gave them four and there's only two of them, so they gave them ours, gave, gave their extra ones to us, but Courtney doesn't believe she's a winner. But now we're waiting to find out how much bingo is because we're thinking we want to play, but I don't know how much it costs, so we're going to find out, and then maybe we'll play bingo, if not... It looks like we might be going into a storm, so we can't go up on deck. So we'll have to find something else to do. What colors do you have, Gabe? So I decided to do bingo. Wait. Did the electronic version, no, so no, I don't no. have to do anything. The, the lazy way. Okay, you have to say. Here, here's a pen. But I have 48 cards on here. And we'll find out what we have in a little bit. Maybe $5,000 in our pocket. We're going to say we're going to do the green. No, no, I'm wrong. I'm wrong. <laughs> Next one it is. N38, N38, N38. Oh, eight away. It's good if you're like, hey, you gotta put on your jacket, you gotta go. So there's a lot of things that can still be in the Old 73. So we didn't win bingo. Courtney was sad. Very sad, right? So sad. So sad. We're gonna go eat lunch and go to the pool. So leave the camera in the room. And we'll see you guys later. At some point. Oh, look. Leonard is the best. He's our room host, guys. He is the best so far. Like, top tier staff. So, off to the pool and lunch. Alrighty, so, went to the pool, got some lunch, took a nap. You know, got up early this morning. And I'm headed over to La Piazza for our cruise group meetup and get a drink. So, I don't know where everybody was for the cruise meetup because I didn't see anybody in there. That is from our group, so I'm just kind of walking deck four towards the front of the ship. Like it says Vibe and stuff, we're just going to keep walking and see where it takes us. It takes us to the Vibe, we'll turn around and go back the other way. We're going to go explore down here. Well, there's nothing interesting there, so let's keep going to the back, like, back of the ship. I think we're the long way. I'm going against traffic. I'm just going to keep walking on deck four for a minute and see where we go. So I got this elevator myself. It's the one you can see from inside the atrium. I'm just walking around to like get ready to go. All right, so we got some pictures taken after Courtney came down and met me in the atrium. Um, I'm gonna use this card. I bought a reusable beer mug, basically, so I just swap this thing out every time I want to get a new drink. Courtney wants just the popcorn bucket. We're gonna get a beer. We're gonna go in and see the Ventrilo show. We saw the adult version last night. This is the family version. Then we're gonna head to dinner at Royal Court. There's no recording in the Walt Disney Theater, so we'll see you at dinner. So between the show and dinner, we came up to the pool deck and watched some Zootopia. This is the end of it. But look at that moon. Just look at that moon up there. So we got some Zootopia. And we're getting ready to head down to dinner. Cordy's here relaxing too. On her phone, it's okay. But we're gonna head down to dinner at Royal Court and we're not eating escargot. But let's go get some dinner. And here's our towel. What is it? It's like a frog. It is a frog. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> With four chocolates. <gasps> for me. I'm joking. He's cute. Where's our blanket? It's up here. Oh. <laughs> uh, we've literally been putting the chocolates here and. Well, only that's theirs. Those. Oh no, there's the rest of them. 
right there. So. Put that towel in the water for the night. Well, we just got back from the tube. Tube is very entertaining for adults, guys. Declan, if he's on the fantasy when you're here, is hilarious. He reminds me of one of my friends back home who, I don't know why he reminds me, because they don't sound the same at all, but they kind of look alike a little bit, but, you know, he's a better version of that of him. But, yeah, so Declan's hilarious. And then we saw Kid Ace do an illusion show, magic show. It's impressive. I'm not, but I'm like, I don't know if I enjoy magic shows, but yep. Uh, Royal Court for dinner tonight. Uh, we both started with the Brie. Then we both got the French onion soup. I'm trying to think what we got. French onion soup. And then we both got the filet steak. It's not a filet meat, no, it's a plain filet steak. It's kind of like pot roast consistency meat, so I don't know what it really was. I got the salmon. I've determined seafood on the boat is not for me. It's too seafoody. I can taste the fish. It smells like fish. It good seafood, in my opinion, does not smell like raw fish. Raw, uncooked fish, meat counter, stinky seafood counter at the grocery store. That's kind of what my conclusion has been the past two nights. So, but tomorrow, brand new day. We're finally going to be in our first port of call of Tortola, which is the British Virgin Islands. We have the Beach Town Express excursion booked, which I think is what it's called. And Courtney, excited to go to the beach? Yeah. Yeah, she's excited to go to the beach. I think we're kind of excited to get off the boat. Like, we've done a lot in the last two days on and off camera, a lot off camera, just because, you know, going to the pool, a little weird to take a camera with us, but I think we've had a good time, so off to the beach tomorrow, a little bit of shopping, picture in front of the BVI sign, you have to get that picture, you don't have a choice, you know, it's kind of like a requirement. But other than that, tomorrow's pirate night, so more fireworks, pirate show, lots of good stuff. I think we covered everything we did today. You saw the afternoon was a little weird. I walked around. I thought I was going to a social and there was nobody there. That I, yeah, I'm not too sure what happened that with that. But, yep. Yeah. So, make sure you guys join your fake, uh, cruise Facebook groups. Even if you're not doing the fish extenders, people post random stuff in there. It's kind of fun. But, I think that's going to be it for tonight. Courtney's making TikTok still, which is Courtney Vermillion on TikTok. Follow us on Instagram at chattencore underscore 23. We're going to be posting pictures from our trip, recapping our trip as we go, living on the memories as long as we can because we are having a great time. And then, oh, we saw the ventriloquist again tonight, guys. Um, the same lady we saw in the tube last night, she did the adult version. We did a, she did a family version, which was still very hilarious, very funny. Lynn Tresger, I think is what her name is. I will put it on the screen for a proper spelling. But yep, she's hilarious. And so, saw Kid Ace tonight. Yep, that's it. So we'll see you guys tomorrow in Tortola, the British Virgin Islands. Make sure you like, subscribe, and turn those notifications on on YouTube to keep up to date with our adventure on the Disney Fantasy. And Instagram, Chad and Court underscore 23. And Courtney is going crazy with TikTok at Courtney Vermillion. So we'll see you guys in Tortola.